Welcome back to our channel where we dive into the exciting realm of Web3. Today we're taking a closer look at the growing trend of Web2 professionals joining the Web3 revolution. It's a captivating phenomenon that brings both opportunities and challenges to the forefront. We've seen a significant advancement in Web3 technology with the emergence of new platforms and increased funding interest leading to a remarkable 40% annual growth in the sector. As a result, thought leaders, founders and entrepreneurs from the Web2 world are switching over to endless opportunities presented by Web3. Even at the executive level, we see multiple examples of this migration. Former heads from major companies like YouTube and Airbnb have taken the helm at Web3 Ventures. Clearly, these individuals are driven by a shared vision of shaping the future being part of the platforms that are building tomorrow's metaverse. However, the influx of Web2 expertise into Web3 presents a double-edged sword. On the one hand, their growth hacks and infrastructural oversight can greatly benefit the Web3 ecosystem. On the other hand, mismatched interests and fundamental knowledge gaps can pose challenges to the careful consideration. So let's take a step back and examine the pros and cons of Web2 joining Web3. But why are these Web2 professionals leaping? It all comes down to one word, the future. They envision the metaverse and believe that the platform shaping tomorrow being created today. The chance to be part of the initial stages of something is too irresistible to ignore. They seek freedom from corporate confines and bureaucracy. The aftermath of the pandemic has ignited a desire for remote flexibility and collaboration with a global community of like-minded entrepreneurs and product builders. But perhaps the biggest driving force is funding. The Web3 space has become an attractive destination for those launching new projects, especially when they feel unsupported by the giants of Web2. Many top-tier venture capitalists have chosen Web3 as their preferred sector for investments. Now, let's explore how Web2 can improve and enhance the Web3 landscape. Firstly, their design experience is invaluable. For Web3 platforms to achieve mainstream adoption, they must deliver experiences that are on par with those of Web2, including seamless navigation, easy logins, and intuitive interfaces. The key to success lies in creating a user-friendly, and comfortable environment for Web3. Other benefits of having Web2 professionals on board is their expertise in community growth. They possess valuable knowledge on creating platforms that prioritize positive user experiences and build organic communities based on their first-hand experience. Their impressive track record of developing and managing apps that have garnered millions of users provides a vast and influential network that can significantly drive growth in Web3. Lastly, internal management expertise is a valuable contribution. Web2 projects have well-defined roles and established working frameworks to achieve desired outcomes. Web3, with its more decentralized and remote nature, can benefit from the managerial proficiency that Web2 professionals bring. However, in order to effectively merge Web2 and Web3, it is necessary to shift one's mindset. The key distinction between the two is that Web2 revolves around centralized data ownership, while Web3 prioritizes decentralization. Those in traditional social media or banking fields may need to adapt their thinking to embrace this decentralized approach. It's interesting to note that big names like Google and JP Morgan are looking into Web3 projects. However, their current business strategies may not align with the values of Web3. In order to thrive in this new paradigm, they must create something that challenges their traditional methods and fully embraces the shift towards Web3. Despite the challenges, the convergence of Web2 talent and Web3 innovation has the potential to create groundbreaking products. Web2 professionals find the freedom to experiment, make a meaningful impact and shape the future of the internet. It's a symbiotic relationship with both sides benefiting from each other's strengths. So, watch this space closely as the journey unfolds. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more exciting discussions on Web3 and the future of technology. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.